Here we are once again with the circle of cannabis, and we're gonna spin this again to have it choose something cool to open up here out of these eight things. So I'm gonna give it a little shuffle here, and we'll give it a spin, and hopefully it picks out something good. Come on, circle. Hold on a second here. Hold on a second. I think we're just gonna put this on pause for a second here, because I got something else to check out, something a little special here. It's this. It's JWC's THC Keef number two, OG Kush GE. <laughs> it's quite the mouthful. And this is 22.3%. No, no, 22.8% or 228.9 milligrams per gram. And the package date on this, where is it? There isn't one. What the fuck? There's no package date. Wait a minute, there is. They're hiding it. Those bastards. I found it. It's it's in here. February 19th of what year? 2020. How about that? <laughs> so this is the stuff that's normally around $10 a gram. And I thought it would be cool to check it out. So I got this. And there's just one gram in here because they were sold out of the two one. Otherwise, I would have gotten the two, but I thought it'd be cool to check this out because uh, I've never bought this before. This is just Keef from the uh, their stuff. So let's check out the um, the weight on it here. I'm going to do this a little bit differently because this stuff you can't just sort of pour out. I think I'm going to have to sort of scrape some of it out even. There we go. Checking the, uh, the weight. I noticed that my thing didn't really show it as well last time. Oh, no, that doesn't help. I turn off the light, but that doesn't help. <laughs> you can see it here, 50. It's deadly accurate. So, let's leave this here like this for now. I'm gonna open this up and we're gonna take a look inside. I am excited. Hope it's good. Here we go. There's not too much on the top. Ooh, look down in there. Very nice. Hmm, that's a nice smell. Hmm, is that ever a nice smell? Wow, very cool. We gotta check this out of the microscope too. But first, let's see how much they gave me. Oh, fuck, there's some right up in here. There's some stuck up along the edge. That fucking sucks. Look at that. This top seal is a piece of shit. So they're probably gonna want to switch that. Something not as shitty. It's nice that it doesn't seem to stick as much though. So maybe I will be okay just putting it on here. So let's put this, this awesome cardboard I have on here. And then we gotta zero it out. There we go. Okay, here we go. So this is supposed to be one gram. Oh fuck, it's gonna roll all over the place. What do I do? Hold on, put, put this back. Okay. Change of plans. We're gonna use this again. Let me just smash it out. Ugh. There, nice and clean. Okay, we're gonna use this. Fuck it. Tear. Okay, here we go. Let's see, it's supposed to be one gram. Oh my God! That's one gram in not including the stuff stuck along the uh, rim there. Or the little bit on top, right? But that's all right, look at this. That's perfect, that's exactly what you want. One gram, right? So, there we go. Now what do I do with it? <laughs> okay, so I've turned it all out here onto the uh, this nice cardboard I found. And <laughs> now we're gonna take a look at it with the microscope. Cause I'm curious what this looks like. Well, there we go. I have the um, microscope out on here. Um, it's, it looks like a whole fucking shitload of, uh, of, um, cloudy trichomes and, you know, little bits of little hair, uh, little weed hairs, little bits of the, uh, you can see a tiny little bit of leaf here and there. But, um, geez, this looks pretty interesting. I bet it's going to be awesome. Here's a super close up. Look at this. This stuff is like, I don't know, it looks kind of looks neat. They're not little balls anymore, for the most part. 
Look at that. You can see all the fucking stuff. Look at that. Oh my, what did we find here? I found a little tiny microfiber. JWC. Anyway, so this looks pretty cool. I wonder how it compares with stuff in my grinder. Maybe that would be cool to check out. Let's check that out. Let's check it out. Okay, here's my grinder. All right, we'll do a little comparison. That's kind of a cool idea, I think. Holy fuck. <laughs> Look at this fucking shit. Now, this is a mix, right? This is a big mix. And there's two different types in here. I don't know if you can tell. These are sort of a little ones that look like balls, and then there's, a, there's sort of a lower layer of fine, like very fine looking stuff. So, let's push you to the side for a second, and we'll take a look at this. There we go, now we're looking at mine that I have, and um, geez, you know, mine looks more impressive. <laughs> it's a big mix though, but you can see all the little balls in there, right? You can see them all. Whereas you can't over here. See, that looks like this. This one looks kind of like that. While this looks like this. So, I don't know what causes that, but we'll test them out soon enough. Let's take a look at that lower section. Can I zoom in on that? Oh my god, where's that? Oh, that's along the edge. Look at that. That's like the, uh... Look at all the fucking things on the side. Holy shit. <laughs> There's the lower section. Oh my god, it's like a pavement, a trichome fucking asphalt. Alright, well, whatever. So, man, that looked pretty good. My one, I think. This one looks okay, too. This one looks very nice. So. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to go and try some of this out in my vaporizer. Um, I was trying to figure out what way would be the best to do this. At first I was thinking maybe I'd put a layer of already vaped stuff in there so there's not really anything in there and then put some of this on top. But you know what? I'm just going to go like this and load some of this directly in and just try it like that. So that's what I'm going to do. That way I know what it's like just on its own. Boop. See, we're just loading up. I'm not going to go a whole bowl or anything here, but put some in. <laughs> okay, so this is loosely packed in here in my packs, and uh, I'm gonna go with this. It's like probably about a half bowl. So we'll try that. I'll be back. I'm gonna go try this. I'll be back. Well, I just got inside from testing out this JWC OG Kush GE Keef THC number two, <laughs> and uh, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, at first I had a problem when I was out there. I had to actually switch my packs because as soon as I got out there and I turned on my packs, it uh, powered out. So I had to switch it up with the packs too. But I tried it on that uh, instead of the three and it was good. And then, um, but it was having a hard time because when you start, when you heat this stuff up, it sort of shrinks a little bit. And then it was having a hard time because the way that these packs work is they had to sort of be touching the sides, right? So I took some old... Uh, AVB or ABV. Uh, here's a picture of it. I just took some of this. It was already used. There's nothing really going on here. So I just put that on top of it to sort of push it down a little bit. And then I had the rest of it. Holy fuck, that stuff gets you right baked. <laughs> it does the usual thing. Like, I don't know if you're, if any of you have tried smoking Keef a lot just on your own, but I used to smoke Keef just in the in a pipe. And it always does this sort of thing to your lungs where it almost, it's almost like it reduces your lung capacity for a temporarily. So yeah, it does that. It's got a very strange taste. I have no idea how to even describe the taste. It's, it reminds me of something, but I have no idea what. It's very bizarre. And um, for 10 bucks a gram though, this is pretty fucking good right here. Um, this is sort of, I think this stuff here, for me, I'll just sort of, you know, mix it in with bowls here and there, and just to just to boost it up a little bit. But uh, this is good stuff right here, and the price is pretty, pretty sweet for uh, what you get. So I would definitely buy it again. Definitely, it's it's pretty good. <laughs> Anyways, um, make sure you uh, subscribe if you want to see more videos because I got a lot more stuff coming up. I actually, have four more things to add on to that wheel. 
but I've been told that I should probably just finish the wheel and then do the other four things. So I don't know. If you could think otherwise, let me know. And uh, if you if you want to hit the bell, it'll tell you when a new video goes up. There's a little bell thing somewhere apparently. <laughs> otherwise, we'll see you later. Have a good one.